Hello from Journey Ministries. I am Kawanya Tende and I have Tanya Lede here with me. I have known her over a year now and I have seen such a significant change in her life. And I know she's been high up, you know, highs and there have been lows, but through it all, she is making strides and I am just ecstatic about, about where she is in life and, you know, her love for the Lord, her love for people and her desire to never go back to that past life. And so she was one of my participants in Project Hope earlier this year uh, with Crosswalk Center. I taught there for um, nine weeks. And again, girlfriend, I'm really proud of you. I'm proud of you. Um, you were a participant of Project Hope, and you had a choice to be a part of the class or not. Um, sometimes you were working or had school, but you always managed to come back. And so why did you choose to continue the nine-week program um, that Journey Ministries was offering? I, I decided to continue through the, my healing process. Okay. Understanding different ways to conquer the inner things that I was facing. Okay. The traumas that I couldn't get rid of. I couldn't find no help and through Project Hope I did. So which module resonated to you the most? <sighs> I love forgiveness. Forgiveness was finding hope where you didn't have it hope at all. Okay. Um, understanding that you could be a new creature. It, healing starts with forgiveness. Yes. Understanding of why you should forgive. Not for them, but for yourself. Yes. To close old doors of trauma, open new doors of hope, love, and peace. Good, good. And then with that, how has the module helped you as uh, to navigate through the program you are a part of? So you said forgiveness. So dealing with all sorts of personalities and women that have experienced what you have experienced, what I have experienced, and knowing that forgiveness is key to your walk with Christ. Um, how did you manage to navigate through that? with all the different things that are going on within the program that you're in? Huh. God has a funny way of doing things. <laughs> <laughs> I've ran into a couple of people, acquaintances that I've had in my past. Okay. And God put it on my heart to, you have to forgive. Not for them, but for you. But for you. And once I did, I felt so much more happier and I learned that holding grudges which I could do that right we all can it's not healthy right right you're holding on to something that somebody may not even be that person no more mm -hmm. they may have changed drastically or they may be still stuck in their ways but either way it's not for them it's for you right right and I agree with that one of the things for me in life I never held long accounts I would forgive when people would think, you know, you wouldn't forgive for the things that were done. But forgiveness, like you said, is not for the other person. It's for you. Um, next, would you recommend Project Hope to other women who have experienced incarceration or the trauma um, that carries, you know, with it? And if so, why? Yes, I most definitely would recommend Project Hope. Good. Project Hope is a module that helps you go through different levels of trauma mm -hmm. not just forgiveness you have denial you have forgiveness you have um rejection, rejection. Mm -hmm. it the one that that really will help them a lot mm -hmm. is rejection because once you go to prison or you go to jail you feel like there's no hope mm -hmm. that no one will accept you in society that you not going to prosper mm -hmm. when you go back to what you know. This module will help you understand that there are different avenues, greater opportunities, and chances that are over what you can think God has a purpose. And what you may think is your purpose, he may say is otherwise. Good. And so Project Hope, again, is a uh, Journey Ministries nine-week um, curriculum that deals with inner healing. Um, it's not a one-stop because counseling, you know, may still be a part of uh, the process of healing, but 
you can start here. And so if you have questions about um, the ministry, you can visit the website at www.journey, that's J-E-R-N-E ministries.com. You can also email me um, if you have questions at journeyministries at gmail.com. And again, Tanya, thank you so much for this interview <laughs> regarding Project Hope. Thank you all. Bye.